Hi everybody, and welcome to a, <clears throat> a game that I pretty much know nothing about, other than it looks stylish. Uh, I like the art style in the game. It kind of also the way it was described and what I was seeing, I was thinking at first, oh, here's another goddamn online only game. All you do is multiplayer all fucking day. Which I don't mind multiplayer games, but the overabundance of it where it's like there's no single player shit, I'm just kind of like, whatever. But it did say there is a solo on this, and when I was like, okay, it's got solo, it looks kind of neat, it's got this art style that's, you know, kind of reminds me of the Telltale stuff. I was like, you know, I think I'll try this. So, really, I don't know anything about it, other than it looks like, it kind of looks like your, your characters, the way they fight from what I can see, it almost looks like For Honor. So, let's go ahead and just boot it up, and we'll see what happens. I don't even know, I mean, like, if you gotta create a character... Well, maybe this is actually just, uh... The tier. Oh, this would be, like, my race. Okay. Uh... Probably right there. Uh, sex, male or female. Eh, let's go with the male. I can't rotate my character. Okay, well, I'd like to see how this hairstyle looks, but okay. Wild, smooth, slick, bald. I I I, I can never stand bald characters. I, I don't know why. It just yeah. Oh, dreads. Yeah, let's just go with that. Balanced combat style with a slight focus on strength. Active ability parry. Blocks completely the attack and stun your opponent. Improves mainly strength and vitality. Dismisses the stun of the attack. Lose health can be recovered. Oh. And please main avoids and slows down the attack. You know, just because I've never played the For Honor series and this reminisces me a lot from just watching it. Let's just go, I I'm guessing where it says difficulty is maybe like how hard it is to get used to that style. So let's just try Cult Method. Name, Absolver. What my name is. I'm a wrestler. Like I'm hoping that I was like I mean that's what I read on the the PS the PS store page is like oh there's single player I'm like I hope so because I'm not gonna sit here and play a game that's always always like these types of games. I imagine you have people who are so competitive, it's just like, that is not something I want anything to do with. Oh, am I like Doctor Strange? I'm learning from a master.
It's like the mask from Jim, you know, Jim Carrey. Okay, so it looks like square and triangle are the attack. Oh, okay, maybe that's block. I don't know over here. Oh, please, God, tell me we have a praise the sun emote. even know if this is the right way but whatever okay so that's how you run you L3 okay hello planes of a doll I'm kind of wondering well I shit it looks like I could just walk right off the edge of the map let's not do that hold and change okay So there's a stamina bar as well. Square, square, square. Oh, that was weird. I mean, I get why it's so. Oh. Your combat deck has four stances. Each star starts with different attacks. Enter each stance once. <laughs> Alternative attacks change your stance, allowing you to chain smoothly with other attacks. neat I don't know why I had to target the door just to do that Guard also allows you to cancel an attack if pressed immediately after attacking. Oh, that's neat. Get out of here. That's cool, okay. Like, whoa. Hey, buddy. I mean, I didn't have to kick your ass, but... Okay, so I can keep going. I wonder... Yep. Yeah, I kind of like this. 
you know, it's got the the nice uh, stylistic. You know, the, it's like like I said earlier, it kind of reminds me of Telltale, but it's also that it reminds me of uh, Wind Waker. Like when I see these kind of animated things like this, I'm like, yeah, it's kind of Wind Waker-ish. Not completely, obviously. There's no like 100% cell shade in here, but it's the thought that counts. Bitch, I will kidney punch you so hard. I could interact with that, but let's... Let's look around for a minute. Well, ooh, shit. Well, I mean, maybe find and defeat Cillin or Salon or whatever his name is. Okay, I guess we can do that. So let's go. Oh shit! I'm playing Dark Souls again. Doesn't open from this side. I gotta level up. I. What the fuck was that? Meditation. Okay. So I can level up a bit here. Uh, and it looks like I've got scaling here too, so. Okay. Building strength is not a matter of gaining muscle, volume, or mass. It's about channeling the energy of both the body and the mind for maximal power. Increase damage or attacks based on strength. Developing one's dexterity was an important tradition in the adult imperial family who valued grace and precision in movement. Increase damage of attacks based on dexterity. So that was a D scaling it looks like. Unless these are just like, here's how they're ranked, like, I don't know. Vitality is really about learning to tolerate pain and trauma. It is more of a... Oh, God, there we go. It is more of a state of mind than a physical limit. Increases... Increase maximum health. Okay, it's pretty simple. Um, well, I guess these also show what I have in points, too. Um, wait, no, no. Having a good resistance to... Effort is important for warriors and workers alike. Increase maximum stamina and therefore allow one to chain or guard more attacks. Storing release intention in shards requires a, different, a significant mental effort. Increase the quality quantity of tension caught and stored in a shard while performing... Okay... I don't even have a weapon. Um... Okay, so stamina. I, I say let's go for endurance. Prospect mask. Masks given by guides to prospects who come to Tower Point without having carved their own. Some say the broken eye was made in homage to Simeon's scars. Miss mythical red essence mask. Some oration 
mines contain reserves of red essence is rare and therefore desirable. Uh, can I equip that? All right. Okay, so I got an undertop, a tunic. Wait, ooh, a tunic. Yeah, it's going to lower my damage a little bit, I think, but... I mean, you got to look good. Heal. Okay. All right, so we are ready to go. Absorb. While locked, you can do any directions just before being hit. Okay. Punch that statue made out of stone. That's a real good idea. Oh, five bucks says here's my locked door. Oh, it's a miracle. I don't know where that goes. I don't want to mess with it right now. I can't go that way. Well, it's, I guess I suppose there is there is that way that. Well, no, because you can't get over there. So I guess I have to go this way. Okay, that's fine. It's a little linear, but I mean, whatever. I oh shit. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Would you stop hitting me? God! Uh, quit beating my ass! Oh my Jesus Christ. Like, he was really beating my ass for a minute. I was just like, stop. Meditation. Uh, this time, let's go for some strength. I'm going to be able to put somebody's fucking face in the ground. Just be like, bruh. Talim, I will try to help you as you progress, but if you lose yourself to the fold, I won't be able to save you. Okay. Those who wear the mask are not all your enemies, you know. I will not attack you. Oh. When you are safe, you can enter meditation and practice your combat deck. Meditation, you can practice and edit your combat deck. Okay. Yes. Ok. 
Okay. Thanks, dude. I'm not going to really mess with that right now because, I mean, I don't have anything to use on it. Jesus Christ. Oh, wow. He attacked his buddy. Could you get... Yeah, let's tag team his ass. I was like, all oh, three of them at once? I mean, come on. And trust me, game, I figured that out already. Okay. Well, this looks, this looks pretty nice so far. At first, I was... I mean, just from the whole aspect of the online stuff, I was really skeptical, but I, I like this. It's enjoyable and fun. You know, the combat's going to be one of those things I'll probably have to get used to, but it's like, hey, uh, no, I could do it. Wish I knew about the story. Okay, I'm in a new area now. That's cool. Whoa, screen got really weird for a minute. Now I'm wondering, it's, I mean, Guidance Bridge. Where the game's called Absolver. It almost makes me think like, I don't know, some kind of like spiritual thing, like we're absolving our sins. Something. Whatever the K, hello? Sinbad. To become an absolver, you will have to prove your worth and defeat Rizzer. I was reading that. But first, you must beat Coretz in the Colosseum, kill Nora and her brother Cargill in the old birdhouse, and the six marked ones roaming the city and forest. Okay. Only then will the stone gate at the interior Imperial Tower open. This headstone will show you remaining tar show your remaining targets. Okay. Beware of these foes; they will not be defeated easy. Well, they're called bosses for a reason. So, uh, what if I go ahead and just activate that altar? Ooh. Okay. That's neat. Okay. So. I have, like, no guidance of any kind, but let's just go out and see what we can find. This is a really nice landscape. I like this. What the hell is this? Nothing? Maybe a checkpoint, I guess? I don't know. I really like this, like, you know, I'm, I don't think this game costs very much to make, but then again, I don't make games, but I'm imagining it's like, hey, this, this is playing nice, and it looks nice, and, you know, it probably didn't cost a hundred million dollars, and, you know, you look at some of those AAA titles when they're like, here's a billion dollars that we spent on this game, and it fucking sucks. Oh, I swear to God. Can I just go back? I, I don't want to... I'm not here to fight anybody. I'm here to try to... I'm not here to fight anybody. I'm here to... 
I mean, maybe they're not gonna actually fight. They're just in the area, but I really don't want to take chances right now. Oh, here we go. So we came in there, the only other, whoa. Oh, okay, that's neat. It's kind of like Dark Souls, where you just see people's ghosts at the bonfire. Uh, so when it said enter the area, maybe that just means they're in the area, but they're not going to, like, attack me, so. But regardless, I've already come back this way. It's It'd be stupid to go all the way back, so let's just go ahead and go this way. Central Harbor. Hello? I mean, I'm, I'm hearing shit breaking. I don't see anybody for miles. No. I don't know what would happen if I jumped in the water, but I'm kind of afraid to... Find out, cause you can't jump. I don't, I don't know why you can't jump. I mean, kind of would seem like a thing you needed to do, but I guess technically you don't, cause if all you're doing is running around fighting, just be nice to act like I'm human. Like, oh, look at me, I can jump. I, I got free will. Oh shit. I think that kick really helped out. I was. Huh. What is this, a bonfire? Elite scout plates. Okay. Uh, maybe I should put a shirt on. That's protection. I think I'll leave it alone for just a minute. Oh, I have a level up, okay. Let's go with that vitality, can't say no to that. Okay, fuck it, what's gonna happen? Oh, that's not good. And I had a feeling that was going to happen, because why the hell wouldn't it? I mean, I guess it let... Oh! That's pretty neat. Uh, so I was right. I was right. That was a checkpoint. Kind of a weird checkpoint, but a checkpoint nonetheless. Okay. There's no point in going down there. No, I did... Oh, jeez. I know there was something down here. That may have been... Okay, yeah, it's just this area. Now, I can go that way, or I can stay over here. Ah, fuck it. Let's go first area. Oh, my God.
Hunter pads. Yeah. Hunter pads. Okay. So it looks like in each area you've got a boss character that you're going to have to take down. Whether you're doing it by yourself or having help or helping others, whatever the case. There's there's bosses, basically. So let's see what we can do here. If somebody's following me. They need to stay the hell away from me. Oh shit. there was somebody standing back here and I saw those two and I'm like what are you doing holding somebody up but no it's just my stupid eyes playing tricks on me hello is there anybody in this area that, that shouldn't be here I don't even I'm already lost because I'm just running around whatever Oh wow, in a really nice place. Yeah, let's just let's go back because I hear fighting. Jesus H. Christ. I'm about to get my ass killed. Yeah, I'm dead. That was fun, but odd. Well, I, I had some fun with that. I'm actually getting a little tired, though, so I'm going to get off of here. But I, I would definitely say this is probably something uh, uh, I'll go ahead and play it a little more. Um, if I can't really get used to the combat, though, I'll probably just, unfortunately, have to pass on it. Because, I mean, if it's just one of those types of things where I'm not good at it, I'm not going to play it and try to get, you know, enjoyment out of something I'm not able to do. So I'll give it I'll give it a little more, but uh, for now I think that's all right. So I will see you guys again.